Well, good morning, guys. It is Sunday, the 2nd of December today. Uh, as you can see, I'm down the river again. As you can probably also hear, uh, I'm not in the best of health still, although I am getting a lot better. Uh, I've been doing short hours at work, so I'm definitely on the mend. Uh, but this chesty pneumonia seems to have worked its way up and it's sort of in my throat now, on the top of my lungs. But uh, I am, as I say, feeling a lot better. So what I've done is come out just for a couple of hours this morning. It's uh, about 8.30 in the morning now. I've come out uh, to this uh, sort of slow run behind me here. Uh, we're just actually above the lock and the weir. Uh, so it's fairly steady. Uh, it's eight or 10 foot deep. Um, Anastasia and I come up here and have a little dabble with the float rods and stuff, just to catch some small stuff. But I thought uh, I'd bring the center pin and uh, the stick float up here and just have a little uh, run through just sort of here is where the main flow is on, on that far side um, just as it runs towards the weir uh, just going to do a couple of hours because I'm not in 100% health as, as, as you can hear um, but the river was in, seems in such great condition that, uh, that I thought I'd come out uh, air temperature is about 13 degrees as well this morning it's rained in the night river's up probably I would say 18 inches uh, it's about uh, 18 inches of visibility as well. It's a lovely colour, sort of greyish charcoal with a tinge of green. Uh, and it all looks really good. Um, so, couldn't resist to be honest. Uh, everyone else is at home in bed. Uh, so, as I say, I've come out just maybe for a couple of hours, just um, see what we can do, see if we can have anything out. Uh, so, fingers crossed, what I'm going to do is, um, as I say, the main flow is perhaps six foot off the far side. So what I'm gonna do is just get a couple of balls of just mashed bread in there and just run some maggots over the top. Um, uh, just got some maggots and some bread, that's the idea. I'm gonna keep firing maggots in. Um, the only downside is this, uh, <laughs> this orange thing you can see in the sky here, it's supposed to be overcast, uh, but it's patchy. Um, but unfortunately the sun's out and uh, when that gets on the water I think that'll kill it, any chance of a decent roach but uh, I was hoping to have some nice roaches, some nice rudd in here as well, obviously chub uh, and there's a few tench around here as well so who knows, who knows um, a bit breezy as well, a bit more breezy than they forecast but I'm wrapped up nice and warm, got my thermals on, got my, uh, my old motorbike snood thing on as well, keep my neck warm so uh, I'm plenty warm enough and uh, get moving and uh, get casting and it'll soon warm me up even more, won't it? Well, that's great, we're having a few. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> exactly what I came for, brilliant. Well guys, uh, as you can probably see from the chop, the wind's really picked up. Um, it's making it almost impossible to fish here, to be honest. Uh, it's blowing a big bow in my line. Um, it's dragging the float upstream because uh, the other problem is there's not a lot of flow either. I don't think we've had as much rain in the night as, uh, as they forecast. So uh, it's making it pretty much impossible to fish here. I think what I'm gonna do is, 
we're going to walk just down below the weir. Um, there's a couple of spots down there, which uh, which I think probably a bit more suitable for these conditions. So uh, I'm going to head off down there and uh, see what we can do. something <laughs> it's doing its best to get under that tree Very strange plodding fight. <laughs> well, of course, that's a great result. Fantastic, exactly what I came out for. <laughs> no monster, is it? But brilliant. That's great on trotting gear. Really pleased with that. He's desperate to get under that tree. I did think it was a big perch, one of those big perch from down there, but uh, I'm not going to complain at that. That's brilliant. Hopefully, we can have a few more. Fantastic, the move's paid off. <laughs>
well the wind's picking up as you can uh, probably hear this is great fun on uh, on trotting gear <laughs> another one there fantastic put up a great scrap on this uh, on this light gear just what the doctor ordered absolutely fantastic <laughs> Well, <laughs> like peas in a pod this morning. This is great fun on light gear though, trotting through, watching that stick float disappear. Great fun, absolutely brilliant. What a great time. <laughs> Well guys, as you can see, uh, I'm back up above the lock now. I'm actually on my way home. Um, the fishing died down below the uh, weir where I was having those chub, the weir and the lock. Uh, pretty much when the sun got on the water, to be honest. Um, after that last nice chub I had, I've had a couple of little chub and a roach, uh, and a couple of dace. Uh, and then for the last 20 minutes, didn't have any bites at all. Uh, I did think perhaps I'd, uh, I'd wet a line in here again just for 20 minutes on the way home it's about half 10 quarter to 11 now but um, to be honest with you the wind's picked up even more and it's just it's just uh, really really difficult and I've stayed longer than I was going to anyway I had a fantastic morning so uh, brilliant to be back out on the bank and, and very fortunate really that the wind was blowing I ended up going down there but then again you never know Mark caught something big up here who knows but no I'd, I've had a fantastic morning um, uh, hopefully I've damaged my health anymore. I'm sure I haven't. It's lovely and warm. I'm actually sweating, to be honest. I've got so many clothes on. Um, but as I say, I'm off home now. So uh, the plan is, I think in the week, uh, I'm going to get out Xander fishing. That's the plan. A um, bit less effort than, uh, than this trotting, uh, sitting behind dead bait rods. But uh, I'm going to have a go, I think, in the week. Uh, down on the, the private stretch uh, where you've seen me catch Xander before. Uh, it's just the weather for it. The water conditions are perfect, so it's going to be, I think, earlier than later in the week. But for now, thank you very much for watching. Tie lines, enjoy your own angling. I've certainly enjoyed this this morning. First time out for, for six weeks, really. Um, apart from one little session I had for about half an hour down here <laughs> with a float rod uh, a couple of weeks ago. 
the first serious session anyway uh, for six weeks so I was itching to get out and had, had a great time and I hope you enjoyed uh, enjoyed seeing uh, me doing a bit of trotting which I don't normally do but uh, I'll be doing it again definitely thanks for watching bye